Welcome back to my Let's Play for Dot Hack Quarantine. No, I haven't found enough virus cores for all of these areas yet. I only have enough for one of them. I'm close on another one, but I still need to hunt down like four more cores, I think, or three. Something like that. I'm um, just J and K cores. I've got enough of um, everything else. It's just, you know, finding time to get them. Oh, it has to be four if I got zero K. I need three K and three J for each of these, I think. Something like that. So, yeah. I still gotta do some hunting. But, yeah, if I get a bonus episode up to make up the one I missed, it'd have to be doing Rachel's area this week. I wanna do a whole lot of episodes, and, like, today and the next, um, like, 11 days, but I'm pretty much already admitting to myself I can't possibly do it because it'd require me to do more videos in a day than is reasonably expected from someone that's, you know, working a full time job. There's no way I could do, like, 14 videos a day, it'd be impossible. Not the sort of schedule I run. So, yeah. I guess we can just try and knock off as much as possible, though. I mean, it shouldn't be too much longer, I'll actually break 4,000 videos. Ugh. Of course, I'd like to get caught back up on some of the backlog on um, Bargain Bin Saturdays, too, because that series has been lagging for a while now. And I've got recordings of several movies on my computer right now just pull clips from for that stuff and I haven't done anything with it I really need to just to free up hard drive space okay let's try and do this fast of course even fast might take a while when you get to the more powerful monsters they can really take a pounding oh well, that was nice of the game giving me a free item okay Technically lock this snake. Let's see, um, that way, yeah. Oh yeah, time for you to take a nap. And then die horribly. I guess if it broke, I could have trained it. Hoped I got core in here. That would have been definite plus. If only. Oh, if you're wondering, that's, um, the Staff of Truth being held there by Mistral. Yes, there's a weapon called the Staff of Truth. Or at least it's not, at least it's not called a Sword for Truth or something stupid like that. Of course, I'm not I'm sure how a Staff can be compro comprised of the Truth. And yeah, I'm pretty, um, sleep-deprived at the moment, so if I start to babble, don't be too surprised. <laughs> the headache ain't helping either, but... Two hours of sleep is not a lot of sleep, man. It's gonna catch up with me at some point tonight. <sighs> okay, let's see. Fairy's Orb. Um, I'm not sure where I need to go. It's too far away. Well, take a guess, I guess. Ooh, a free item again. Oh, this dungeon's pretty nice to me when it comes to free items, man. Bit weird. Just looking and see it. Oh shoot, these guys. I hate these things. Um, I guess they go to sleep easily enough. If you have a big level advantage over them, because quite frankly, they are irritating. Yeah, let's just really move this thing. Last I checked, my gauge is pretty darn full, so I just want to take you guys out. I guess I can double check it. Eh, I'm still more green than I'd like. And I don't think these guys really drop virus cores anyway. Nope, still green. Screw it. I'm told you get a better chance of virus cores, you know, when you're at um, lower levels of infestation, so it makes sense to wait on that. Oh, we did manage to guess right. That's good. Oh, let's see. Oh, that was useless. Oh, this is with the sleep. 
That's the actual truth is, um, this rocks has the three different powerful summons. Um, Earth, Fire, and Darkness, I believe. Yeah. So it's kind of useful, but it sucks when she uses the wrong kind of magic on a target right off the bat, don't it? Especially once the Dark Point is going to cost 110 to summon. Yeah, that's a lot of energy to invest and then have it be completely wasted, isn't it? It's not even gonna work. I'm gonna have to get up close and personal to take these things down. Good thing he doesn't know a cure spell. Okay. Yeah, physical attacks. Enough, I guess, but I don't think that thing's close enough to hit multiple targets in three hard right now. I thought so. It's not a bad one, but not what I wanted. I'll try again, though. Second time lucky, maybe? Wow, um, free HP recovery. Well, at least it was a positive effect. That doesn't happen too often. Usually it's a negative one. And you're like, gosh darn it. Bracelet, did you have to hit me with such a negative status condition? Okay. Well, alright, Slice, I'm gonna have to do at least three battles. It's unavoidable unless some of those rooms turn to be cheddar chest. Ah, uh, figures. Oh, now it's helpless again. Eh, not worth it. Let's see, um... Fire. Trying to burn it out of existence. Death by cape on fire, that has to suck, man. Okay. Well, I prefer put us to sleep and we're reading it. Did you have to do that again, Mistral? Can't you just tell us the darkness hole and you're wasting your own time? That's all tolerant. It's so weird to have two well after it to say tolerance. Or tolerant. I think they could have come up with something better for that, you know? Well, let's get the trap out of the way. Probably gonna sell that off. I got enough room for a ton of those in my chest box, you know? They take up room, and I usually don't have to use them anyway. Usually the more basic mage soul gets along just fine. And stocking up on Arsenal Souls requires spending a crap ton of money. We're going to an area where I guess I can randomly pop boxes for them, but I ain't got high hopes for that. Uh, so I figured most areas I could go to, I'd probably end up finding them for souls more than um, what they else finding um, Arsenal Souls. Emperor Souls are definitely more useful, but still, it consumes a slot in the item list, you know. I can only carry so many items, 40 unique ones, so it really sucks. So one thing that bugs me about the um, sequel series of this game is they also have a lot of um, strict item limits, so it's hard to carry out all the stuff you want, you know, which just gets old after a while. Skill. 
death. Data bugs tend to be tough. Even if you're over up, which is a bit strange, but I guess it broke quickly enough. Fairs to some of them. Uh, basics probably the best. X, huh? Take more than it did. Since they're not forcing us out, I guess we should go try and pick up that loot. Ugh, starfish. Oh, that's alright. It's not gonna last that long, though. Okay. Yeah, I thought so. Probably got a chance to do anything for kick the bucket. This is probably where the items are being kept. Made in heaven, huh? There's the Maiden Heaven. It's a rare sword. Gotcha. That's wood based. Now, where I'd be if I was the Sky Vessel? <sighs> oh, no, not in there. Oh, there it is. Vessel Sky. So it's a treasure item. Gotcha. I figured it'd be some sort of armor or something, not treasure. I mean, I get the golem parts being treasure, considering I played Wild Arms 5, and that game, anything golem related was like a big find. Whether it was part or whole, the world was going golem crazy, that was. <sighs> but in this game, I guess you probably just sum off, because they're probably from some ancient broken down golem you don't even know the location of. You probably don't care. Because you got enough stuff to do when it comes to saving the world. Well, that'll do for this episode. Till next time, then. See ya.